Sir, are you lost? You cannot be here. Be another way in. Quarters fit for a Hanifa. Garden and its mysteries. Not much spice to the title. I guess that was the idea. Abu Abdullah's ambition knows no bounds. Too far off. He cannot still be. You. Kabiha might have been lax about lateness, but I am not so lenient as she. I am sorry, Farah. It will not happen again. Farah? To you, she Sayyidati. Or Ummu Walad. Go about your duties. Too far off. He cannot still believe he will take the throne. Have you met his mother? <laughs> There you are. Enjoy. Let us hope she does not come up with any more tasks. 
I think I have created a monster. The book is in your room. Now... So? Are my eyes bigger? Huge. Makira, I need the key. This potion, it... it gives you confidence. I feel like I could take on the world. Yes, I am familiar with this potion. We had a bargain, Makira. The key. Now. Wait. You have to return the potion to Nasreen. If Farah finds out it's gone, she'll be furious. Then the key is yours, I swear. Fine. Drink some water while I am gone, will you please? This is the last time, Basim. Put your foot down. Back where you belong. The potion is put back. All is right in the world. Now I will get that key from Makira if I have to pry it from her hands. It is done. I am done. Thank you. Funny, I have a bit of a headache. What happens now? You give me the key. Oh, right. Um... You do not have it. You are afraid of Kabiha. What? No, no. Her star is fallen. They all say it. It's just... I was having fun. Here it is. Finally. Now to find my answers. I remember this perfume. I smelled it in the bazaar, and perhaps in the harem. But on who? A hairpin. Nings. When did Qabiha get it? book of Harib's poems. The ocean, the desert, the cobra, and the dove. A map of the Khilafa and Alamut. Yet for its grandeur, the room's all but empty. Things look to be missing, including Qabiha herself. What is this? What did you give her? She always drank from it. She asked me to give it to her. It's harmless. You call this harmless, Nasreen? You should go. Now, give me the key. What happened to her? Me. You really shouldn't have left me alone with that flask. I'll search the rooms. You with uh, me. I did nothing. I did not hurt her. What did you do? Relax. No one is looking at us. They will be far too busy with the book they find in Nasreen's room. Nasreen's room? The garden and its mysteries. Nothing body, just a study of native herbs, their properties medicinal, poisonous, cosmetic. Belladonna, deadly nightshade. It does make the eyes look lovely in small doses. Same I had to waste it all on her. What? You saw them, Farah and Nasreen, dripping poison in everyone's ear, spreading lies and rumors about my mistress. Kabiha. One dead, the other disgraced. No one will hear them now. Yes, Yala. What are you? Loyal. In Kabiha's absence, I defend her throne from those who would supplant her. Her office is empty. She has abandoned you, Makira. You serve a faithless mistress. She will return from the palace when the danger has passed. You really should not have told me that. It makes no difference. You will never find her. Now, play nice. There are children present.
Nice uniform, by the way. Suits you. I can do nothing for Farah. But if Kabiha is the head of the Order, I could still spare those who have yet to suffer at her hands. I need to get rid of these. Beautiful homes, far different from the slums of Anbar. What do you see, Enkidu? Hope she is home. You will not pardon from my guest. This is my house. Bought with my generosity. Bought by my genius. For tokens, favors, and personal dedications, you may find Sayeda Arib in the garden after her recital. Good day. You must be her patron. It is an honor, Sayyidi. If I may, I seek a private audience with the poetess. Do you? I have been moved beyond words by her... words. Symmetry of sky and sea. I only wish to express my sincere admiration. Pretty words. Nearly as pretty as hers. And just as false. We both know what mask she wears, don't we? Mask, Sayyidi. Enough, Sayyidi. I know what you are, and I know why you've come. You think I haven't seen you skulking in the shadows. She's no longer party to your plots, your secret meetings, your foolish nicknames. I have scrubbed her clean of them. For I have set a watch on her door. My men dog her recitals. Every letter she's had of you I have shredded or sent back. Sent back? You will find them piled at the Postal Bureau. Burn them. Bury them. Do what you will. You can choke on them for all I care. Foolish nicknames, secret meetings. The patron may have thought me a member of the Order of the Ancients. The piles of letters at the Postal Bureau may reveal more. 
Let us see what mask you wear, poetess. Postal Bureau. I will do as the Ruyun do. Sift through strangers' mail and sniff out conspiracies. must be mail here from every corner of the Khilafa. Now to find Aribs. Uh, 
Silence your song of sin, or I will do it for you. How kind. Moving on. Abu Abdullah is the true Khalifa and will soon reclaim his stolen throne. I will leave this one for the Uyum. Dearest Arib, your poetry has touched me deeply. You are my oasis, lush and yeah, qarof. After the honey drips from her lips, a Thaleb leaves the garden and follows the mouse. Secret order correspondence? Bad poetry? A bit of both? Harib could be a Thaleb. The patron spoke of a recital in the gardens. I could give this letter to Harib and see where the vixen leads me. Please note that your payment of 15 dinars is overdue and must be... No. I will go to the garden, give Athala her letter, and follow where she goes. Desert, cobra, dove, all shapes and humors will I embrace. Hello there. Have we met? Come, don't be shy. I rarely bite and I never leave a mark. <laughs> It seems there's no privacy in the public eye. How came you by that letter? Who put you up to this? I work in the dark to serve the light. <laughs> I've met the men who serve the light. It seems its glare oft leaves them blind. Are your masters so blinkered and bumbling? You were warned, you son of a dog. Come a reap. We will set no tongues to wagging here. Yours is the tongue that will not still itself, even when I beg for silence. You spurned the counsel of he who raised you, and without whom you would still be nothing? I raised myself. I authored myself. I have written myself into history. You are banished from my pages. Now be gone. How can I leave you to walls such as these? You're a woman alone, unarmed. Words are weapons enough for me. Then let us see what defense they offer. Take her. There is somewhere the Sayyida needs to be, and you are delaying her. It seems that words can summon shields. We will need to make this quick. You're a dead! Right, Yeah. 
Watch your mouth! Ah, you spike! You had the stone! Oh, Arib has left for her secret meeting. I must hurry. The letter commanded Athalan to leave the garden and follow the mouse. Perhaps Arib is not lost to me yet. How far will the fox flee? Yet another painted mouse. You should bring him before the Mazalin court. But he thinks only of my reputation, Sara. To safeguard success, I must be palatable, discreet. He fears I am too proud. <laughs> you? Never. I write that love is feral and free, unbound by strict hero statute. Should I not practice what I publish? Practice makes perfect. It also makes enemies. So be it. But let me choose them. Courtiers, caliphs, patrons, partners, so many men have tried to decide my enemies. <laughs> and friends. Though Allah knows I once chose poorly, he hid himself well. And the poet needs patrons, even one so great as al -Talab. Well, I have my pick. Good. There's trouble times ahead. I will be fine. I have survived six caliphs. I will survive... Six more. Don't worry, Sarah. I'll kiss the rings I need to kiss, but I will not be bound again. Not by anyone. Secret meetings. Coded names. There is no trace of the order here. Still... She has her pick of patrons. Maybe the head of the order is not Arib herself, but an admirer.
Good to see you. Welcome. May I see your wares? Please, take a look. Have some gear to mend? Can I be of further assistance? I must take my leave. Farewell. Nothing can hide from us. No, it is too dangerous, Enkidu. Why couldn't we be posted to the souk? Protect the merchants for a little extra soon.